Hi there, it's Nina Nandagopal at almostpractical.com and today I want to introduce you to the Erin Condren Life Planner Binder. If you're familiar with the Erin Condren Life Planner, then um, you'll be pretty excited about this binder as well because it's the um, standard life planner pages in a binder format. So you have a little bit more flexibility with adding new pages and um, have, you have a little bit more space for your planning. Now, um, the life planner binder comes in a, um, a, in a, a choice of about five different covers. So the first thing you would choose is the binder itself. And I chose what's called the sapphire blue color. And it's covered with sort of a linen fabric that, um, that I think looks really nice. Um, and I did also get a second one in a gray covered fabric. And uh, that video um, will be separate because the format that I chose for the inside is a little bit different. So the first thing that you choose is the binder. And then you can choose whether you want some personaliz personalization or not. And I decided to put my initials on here in um, silver but there's a couple different choices uh, that you can go with. And you can go up to four characters. So you could also put the date on here instead of your initials if you'd like. Um, so let's take a peek inside. Um, inside is um, the Erin Condren pattern on the inside of the um, binder. And then you have a vellum sheet and then your planner pages. Now the planner pages, you get a choice of um, going with a um, a daily layout, which is new, and that's what this is. This is the um, the daily layout, which is one page per day, per weekday, and two um, one page for both days of the weekend. And I'll show you the layouts. Um, so you could do the daily. You could go with a weekly layout, which is. Um, uh, either the standard vertical layout, an hourly layout, or a horizontal layout. And the gray binder that I referred to earlier that I got is the horizontal um, weekly layout. So that's in a different video. This is the daily layout. Um, and I also, the other choice you have is whether you want to go with neutral or a colorful uh, theme. And I went with the colorful theme for this binder. Um, and so with the daily layout, let, let's, let's just dive right in, shall we? <laughs> so you get at the beginning of the month, a couple pages for planning, which is a, a blank page here and a place for birthdays, monthly goals, kind of um, blank lines and a little bit of a dot grid area. And then you have your monthly tab and then you get a full, um, a full month spread here. And then behind that, you get into your daily pages. And you can see here, I have a one page for the weekdays. This is Wednesday and Thursday. And these pages have um, an hourly one column for you to outline your day um, on an hourly basis. So it starts at 6 a.m. and goes to 9 p.m. with a couple extra lines in case uh, your day lasts a little bit longer than that. And in the second column, there's a section to write your tasks or your to-do items. And then a blank section at the bottom where you can write a note or put a sticker or whatever, um, whatever you, you, whatever works for you on that day in your planning. Um, so there are eight rings, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, um, and um, in gold inside the binder. And the way the daily layout comes is you actually get four packets, um, so one quarter in each packet. And and what I did, because you, you can't really put all of the page, the daily pages into the binder at once. It would be too many because you have one page per day. So what I did um, was I put in one quarter. So I have January, February, and March, the full quarter. And then I just put in the monthly tabs for the rest of the year. So that if something comes up for, say, September or later on in the year, I can at least outline that on 
um, on the monthly layout and then as the quarter comes closer I can take out the months that have already gone by um, and um, file those away and then add in the upcoming months. So that's, that is my plan and it seems like I think that's going to work out really well. I don't know if you can hear my dog barking but she's feeling a little left out downstairs there. Um, okay, so what else do you get with the Erin Condren Life Planner Binder? Um, you get, and I just passed it up, but you get this, um, the ruler, um, which is great. It's a snap and ruler. And if you can see, it's really, um, it's the same, the same attachment, I guess, if that's, if that's what you call it, it fastens the same way as, um, as the coiled binder, the traditional binder. So whatever accessories you had in that binder, if you have an older life planner, um, you can use those to snap right into, um, into this binder as well. So that's kind of nice. Um, you can use all your um, Erin Condren accessories in this. Of course, I'm having a little bit of trouble snapping it in here on the video. There we go. And um, and then at the end of the binder, you get um, let's flip to that. You get some awesome stickers, and I think the stickers have really you know gone up in in I, w I don't want to say quality, but in design. I guess that's the right um, that's the right word. Uh, my first life planner I got many years ago, um, and these stickers are just beautiful. Um, they just, they're colorful and they have, you know, the gold foil. Again, this is the colorful layout. And so if you get the neutral layout, the stickers are probably going to be a little bit different colors. Um, but what I really like about them is they're actual stickers that are really functional. Like you can write little notes on there or flag things, put a little, um, sticker beside an important event. Um, as opposed to being overly motivational, um, I do love motivational stickers, but um, but I really like the functional ones better because they remind me of appointments that I would otherwise probably miss. Um, so you also have this page of stickers, which is a lot of fun because these especially, they have seven little circles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you, if you have a goal to, you know, maybe drink a drink, a glass of water every day or eight glasses of water every day um, you can check off um, a circle for each each day that you get that done or you know anything that's repetitive you can use these stickers in that nature so that's um, very useful actually and then there are um, some fun stickers to commemorate birthdays and other events that go on in your life um, and then just a, a blank page of um, little sort of rectangular stickers or markers that you can use to highlight something. So stickers are beautiful. And, um, and then finally you get the, um, the folder, which is perfect for capturing any, um, any loose papers or receipts or anything like that. So, um, this is the daily layout of the life planner binder. And as I, said at the beginning, and I actually forgot one layout, um, they, the, this comes in the daily layout, in the weekly layout, with either the vertical, the horizontal, or the um, hourly, or you get a choice of a monthly layout. So I imagine, I did not get a monthly uh, binder, but I imagine that would be more um, of just the um, monthly the mon monthly spread here, with some pages for notes and things like that. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this tour of the Erin Condren Life Planner, um, binder in the daily la layout, which is really new, um, for me, like it just, I'm just really excited about all the space that I have. I do, I'm a note taker and I jot things down. And so to have a whole page to record the events of my day is, um, is really exciting. So, um, I hope you'll stop back check out my other video with the uh, the horizontal layout um and 
um, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. This is Nina Nandagopal at almostpractical.com.